I right, got done with that park. I want to do Harmonic Hills, but I'm wondering if I should do the dam level first. <laughs> um, year three. This park may, may be kind of a challenge. I, I want to check all of the parks to see if it's like a three-year park or not. I know... I think all of these guys... Coaster Canyon is three... I took a look at Roman Village. Roman Village is going to be a challenge, but it might be an easy park to do. Uh, Sprightly Park might be an issue. So the only thing with Sprightly Park, I will say, is that I cannot borrow any money. Of I cannot borrow any money from the bank. So I either would have to, I'd have to destroy attractions. And I don't know if I want to do that. I kind of want to keep the money being made off of like the rides that are already there. These two parks, there's nothing there. Harmonic Hills, there's nothing. I want to do Harmonic. You know what? We're going to do Harmonic. We are going to do Harmonic and here's why. I'm actually going to test things out on Harmonic. So let's figure this out. Tree height, right? Okay, fine. Cool. I'm very curious. Okay, fine. Here we go. How high can I make it? Okay. So... And I can't delete the trees. That's fucking wild. Okay. Now, is it stuck right here? Or no, it's not. Okay, so it looks like... Twenty-two. So, twenty-two degrees up from the current plane. Is what we're working with. Now, does it also apply to down here? Okay, 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 okay. 22 from the ground is up. Okay, that's what I wanted to know. That's all I wanted to know. We're going to hit pause. So what is the current ground height at? Now, we have a decent park to work with. Okay, so some of the hilly stuff is going to have to be like... Okay. I only ask because I wonder what the height is of some of the roller coasters I have. If there's any roller coaster I could get away with maybe building on a place like this, it is going to be the Virginia Reel. That is going to be the only roller coaster I can do. So. We have limitations on height. We also have limitations on the trees. Which kind of sucks. What is what? What is it that we need? Is it twelve hundred? Yes, that's easy collapse. We can do that. Um. Hmm. So if we can't remove any of the forest, right? Hmm. Okay. All right. What do we have? We have no roller coasters. That's fucking fine. Okay. Okay. Holy shit. Uh, okay. We need to get drink and food right the fuck, get, right the fuck out of the get-go. I may not do anything, actually. This is going to be a park where I may not do anything for the first video. I'm going to be very limited as to what I do. I'm probably going to build a couple of rides. And maybe that's it. But I'm not going to be doing anything else. The park is not going to be open. I'll tell you that fucking much. And that's fine. I don't know if this is going to be a place where people are going to want gentler stuff. And if that's the case, I got no problem building the train. Um, I really don't think we need a transport right here. So, 
I feel like waiting in line, right? I feel like waiting in line down here for the train. Once the train gets to the station and you get loaded up onto the train, you can walk from here to here in about a minute. And I just, I don't know. I feel like the purpose of that is not really that great. So you know what? That's what we're going to do. This park is not open. This park is not going to be open for a while. And I feel like I have to play like that because I can't do anything. I've never been put into a scenario where all I have is just these two things. They are good things, but we have no food, we have no drink. And you cannot run a theme park doing that, so... Now, first order of business is to figure out a path. Now, oh, I can lower land, can't I? Uh, what? You can't do shit? You can't do shit. What the fuck? Hey, yo! What? Dude, this is going to be a fucking challenge. I may have just fucked myself. This is going to be a challenge. I can't lower land. I can't do... I'm so fucking limited. This is really going to test my creativity for stuff. Like, this is really going to test it. How would the local authority even know if the trees are fucking gone? Look how many fucking trees are in this goddamn area, bro. Can I buy land? No, I cannot. We're gonna pause, right? Yeah, no. Of course, I've been having such a frustrating fucking day. I guess uh, that kind of explains as to why my tone during the last year of, uh, of, uh, the last year of Hydro Hills was kind of like, I sounded really cranky. That's pretty much why. Well, I can't put this here. I want the food court to be down here. I like, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I want it to be down here. I should say, I, I want to put this somewhere, like, that would be good, like, but I, like, hardly don't see any 3x3 three three things anywhere. That works. I guess. not a tree down there, is it? No. Hmm. Oh, I can't. Wait, no. Yeah, we figured out those things. We're fine. This park is not going to be open for a while. And that's fair, I guess. Ugh, how do I do this? F sure. Man, I, I, it's been a long time since, you know, I like I said, I go back to fucking Rainbow Valley. I don't know if there's a tree down there or not. I can't quite fucking see it. I don't think so. So this is where my first food court business bit is going to be. Huh? There's a tree right there. Oops. I want this to connect.
Ooh, there's a tree right there. Fuck! Actually, I might be able to jump this. Right? Maybe not. Yeah, see, I can jump that. Fuck you, trees. Fuck you, nature. I figured out Blue's Clues, dog. Don't got shit. Fuck out of here. What you mean? What you think this is? Hmm? So I'm probably going to do, let's see, uh, bathroom here, kiosk down here, uh, food. I can't lower the land. I can't do fuck all, dude. Are we getting a drink stall? Okay, drink stall. Okay, cool. Now, all we need is a food stall. Now, I'm probably going to let the R&D give us three different stalls. So that way we have a little bit of variety of food. That's probably going to be it, honestly. We have no throw rides. We don't even got the fucking train. And the only ride I might be able to successfully navigate is the Virginia Reel. That's the only ride available. That's the, the fucking merry-go-round is the only fucking thing I can make in the park. Like, you are nuts. Well, let's go ahead and get the bathroom and the fucking, like, shit figured out. Because that's, like, the only things I can figure out at the moment. Let's do bathroom right here. What the fuck am I doing? Riveting gameplay from yours truly. Okay, we can get the drink stall made now. I really don't know like what to tell myself here because it's just like I don't I don't I don't I don't know what to tell myself. I'm really hungry. Like IRL. My dad goes to work in like forty minutes or actually really like an hour and I'm just like I want food. I haven't eaten all day and I'm just like kinda hoping like my family and I go like eat out or like get some fast food or something. I'm craving McDonald's. Like I'm absolutely craving McDonald's, and I don't know why. Cause I was craving a little Caesars for a little bit, and then I was just like, nah. Now I kind of want some like I don't know what I want, man. Like I don't even know if I want nuggets. Nuggets sound good right about now. I have that thing on my fucking phone. It's uh, 20 nuggets, and you get like two medium fries with it. I might do that. And then maybe my sister and my mom could split like one of those buy one get one for a dollar things. So like. And then, like, it'd be, like, two sandwiches, a 20-piece, and two medium fries between all four of us. Or maybe we'll just... Or maybe I'll just go get Little Caesars anyway. Because Little Caesars, it only costs, like, 11 or 12 bucks for all that food.
<sighs> All right, uh, you know what, here. <clears throat> we don't have a lot to think about or do, and that's fine. However, I want to make two food courts. We're going to have a food court down here middle. I want a food court up here if I can. There's a lot of flat space up there I could use, though. I'm going to make a food court up here, food court over here. Let's work on this area first. I think I know how I want the food court over here to look. I can't raise in lower ground, so I gotta be very, very, like, tiptoey about this. Can I make it swinging around? Tree and way. Oh, fucking wonderful. This is a tiny ass fucking food court, but it might work. And what I could do is I could do, I could actually do one of these. Maybe? Man, I can't fucking see fuck all. Okay, I can see where the trees are here. So, I want a food court to be here, but I want to be careful with how I do it. I can't... Fuck you! God fucking damn it. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna go here with it. Why is there a tree every fucking count... Dude, there is a tree every diagonal fucking square. Can I cut down one fucking tree just for, like, one instance? This is fucking stupid. One tree. I don't want to use up any of this land because this looks like land I could build like an attraction with. You know? Okay. We're going to delete all this. I totally forgot. I can, I can delete the paths. Like, I can create my own path, like, network here. If I feel like it might help. And it might. We'll see. So can I put something here on the corner? I can. Okay, cool. I'm not trying to do that. Cool. What if I... Right, right, right. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Pause, pause. Settle down. Watch this. Right, right. Oh, ooh, ooh. Watch this. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, look, we got that, right? However, what if we... This fucking path. Every fucking camera angle, you son of a bitch. Fuck you. Stupid ass fucking thing. Okay, pause. What if I do this? Right? Okay. We have figured a, we have figured out something a little bit, you know? I could make it go back and around. Dude, getting getting attractions on this fucking place is going to be something stupid. I need a food court. Like, there is no doubt about it. I just don't know what I want to do with this. I like this idea. In fact, you know what I could do? Oh, wait, though. Wait, that wouldn't work because I don't have... Uh, I don't have an... I can't raise the ground, and I don't know how to get the... I don't... I, I know in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 I can do it. It's like shift, control, 
and you could elevate the freaking like thing or whatever, but I don't know how to do it on this game. Okay, this might work. I don't know if this would work. One, two, three, four. Is there a way to elevate this a little bit? Oh, train the way. F a fucking course. I I have an idea that might work. Right. Oh, I don't know what the fuck you're doing, bro. That, okay, that worked. That actually worked really well. I like that. Okay. In that case, I can get rid of this. Have that there. Okay. That, that actually looks pretty decent. That, this is where our next food court is going to be. It is very fucking janky. I still can't see shit. Candy apple stand? That's the first food stall you give us? A candy apple? You're kidding. You suck. Absolute fucking bonehead fucking... What the fuck ever, dude. Alright, we can put bathroom up here as well. The thing about the bathroom is that I kind of want to put, like, bathrooms, like, in between, you know? Like, I want to put a bathroom up here. Like, right here should be good. Let's fucking... F5 is right. That's good to know. I want to put a bathroom up here. There you go. And then I want to do... Uh, stalls. Okay. Now, we only really have three, like, areas left. Oh, wait, no, that's not true. We can put some right there. Dude, the fact that fucking, man, the fact that there's like hardly anything up here, space for anything is really rough. All right, there's, there's our next food court. What the fuck ever. This video sucks. I wonder if there's like scenarios and maps where people are like they've tried them and they just for the life of them can't do them oh god this place looks like a fucking fucking fun time look at all the trees around here good god well in that case we're gonna do that i want to use i want to utilize areas right that don't have a lot of things going for them like, I don't want to use up this plateau, and I don't want to use this one because rides could go there. So, if, if anything, if, if I want to use anything, it would be the... I would like to use the area with the trees, to be honest. Just because I know I won't be able to fit anything around them. So, like, anything in here might work pretty well. Uh, I'm gonna work on this area right here. So just everybody settle down. We have a decent space to work with. So let's do this. Maybe have this come across. 
Okay. And then we could even do something like, is there a tree right there? Oh, there's not. Okay. There's a whole line of trees right here, so it's going to have to be, we wouldn't be able to cut over, so we'd have to do something like this. And that's fine. This might work. It's, it's a little odd, but it would work. Maybe we could do the, the kiosk right here. Maybe the bathroom can be, I don't know, up here. Or should I have it, like, in with all of this? Oh, shit. I didn't realize that was an actual spot I could use. That's fine. We'll have the we'll have that be right there. This area and this area, definitely, I want to keep, like, intact. For something else. Like, actual fucking things. There you go. All right, so we have our food courts made. We do not have a fucking bathroom down here. They, we, we need to put a bathroom, like, down in this area because of, like, how fucking... Uh, is there, like, an area where I could just throw this thing and that it won't be in the way of anything? Yeah, we could just throw it right here. Oh, tree in the way? Fuck. Uh, here, we'll just throw it right here, then. Fuck, we need... There you go. Bathroom there, bathroom there, bathroom there. Uh, bathroom over there. Probably should have one. Um, so we have one down here at the bottom. We already have one on the left side and one middle. I don't know where this one would go. I guess I could put one. Uh, should I just say fuck it and leave it? Or should I put one down here in the bottom right? I definitely do think there needs to be another bathroom somewhere. Maybe middle if I wanted to connect the top and bottom parts. This may be the most boring. Also, oh, I'm, I could put the bathroom right here, actually. Because there's nothing else there. That's fucking hilarious. Look at that. There was trees on all sides. That's hilarious. Oh, that is so close to that one, though. I mean, I guess I could reposition this guy and put him right here. Or actually, you know what? We're just going to put him on the other side. That way the food can maybe be right there. Alright. Uh, I guess we should get our benches down. This is going to be the most boring fucking playthrough ever, I feel like. Uh, this park especially. Like, there is no shot in hell. This is going to be a good park to watch. Absolutely no shot in hell. Oops. Should probably put these up here instead. And then I don't really have a whole lot to go off of down here, so I'm just gonna put these all down. Say fuck it, dude. This is going to this is going to be the weakest food court of them all, I feel like. Alright, and welcome to the park. I, I can't open it. Like, I legit... What? You are insane. You know, believe it or not, I don't fucking have a whole lot going on right now. 1,200? We can get that. I can get 400 guests in the park. You know what I might actually do? I might not even open this park 
till year two. Because we're getting shafted right now. I'm totally fine with absolutely letting... I am totally fine with... Check this shit out, right? I'm totally fine with the bulk of my money being used for the research and development. Like... <laughs> and that's it, because I know it's not going to bankrupt me. And I've already got some of the food courts down. I've got the three food courts down and the bathrooms placed. Like, I shit you not. I do not mind playing the waiting game on this scenario. I can't do anything. I can't. I have one merry go round. That's it. Well, bam. That's it. I have no thrill rides. I'm going to save the game before I accidentally crash it. I have no thrill rides. I've gotten a hat stand. A hat stand. Yeah, I've gotten a hat stall and a goddamn freaking uh, candy apple stand. Really? Candy apples? No. This seems like it's a cool environment, so I would prefer hot food if I can get them. Anything else is... Just look at this. Look at this. I kind of want to just do throw rides right now. I legit have no idea how to approach this park. I don't even know what I did. I think it was Rainbow Hills on the first game where I couldn't do anything and I still managed to make a crazy ass park. I even remember one of the biggest achievements of that park was I freaking got a couple of roller coasters in there that I didn't think would fit for any reason and I just fucking worked out somehow. Like could I could I even build the build this guy anywhere? I don't think I can, right? Yeah, that's not happening. I can't do anything. We have to sit here and watch. I, I, I legit shit you not. Now, I might make hat stands. Like hat stalls. Because uh, I might have the space for them. But I don't want to abuse those spaces. Because I want to know where these rides are going to go first. If I could figure out ride placements. Then, maybe, I will figure out a hat stalls. But for now, no. You better give me a good goddamn fucking food stall. I'm not going to open the park. I'm not. I'm not going to open the park to you too. I, I need a food stall. A hot food stall. A couple of them preferably. Now once I get two hot food stalls, I'm shipping off. I'm stopping that. And I'm doing, uh, freaking, I'm doing throw rides. Throw rides and general rides, because I need more of them. This park may not get opened till year three, possibly. You may think, Corey, how are you going to pass a park with 1,200 guests by year three? I'll tell you how. I'm going to get the park made, and then at the end, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to save it at the end of June of year two, before we go into July, and I'm gonna leave it closed. And then when March three, when March year three opens, I need twelve hundred people, right? All the rides will have been made. All the paths will have been figured out. The headache will be over, and we are gonna watch this place blossom and just freaking balloon into a nice little theme park. It's gonna happen. You may think, Corey, will your finances last that long? Honestly, it's not even good. Like, yeah, I absolutely think they will. Like, I, you know, I'm on 10G right now. I have 4,300 left. The only thing taking out my money is the research and development. Everything else, nothing. Like, I've done a little bit of landscaping, and that's about it. Other than that, nothing else. This is a... I came into this park thinking the local authority... Uh, doesn't allow you to build above tree height. And I was trying to figure out what that tree height was. It did not say that I could also not delete the trees and also could not raise or lower ground. I was not notified of that. And believe it or not, landscaping... I, the fact that I cannot landscape has just made this a lot tougher. Because now I have to build on uneven terrains and fucking play Jenga with the goddamn paths from entrances and exits up to the main path to get to the guests. And it's just, it's just a super hard... I should have did the Roman Park, man. The Roman Park looked cool. It was pretty small. 
needed you needed 1500 people by the end of year three with a park rating of 600 i'm just like i can do that like absolutely i can do that you know the funniest part is is that the more i play this game the more i realize I, the more i want to play roller coaster tycoon 2 just because when you build the ride the scenery like evaporates itself and i think it's more expensive <coughs> to evaporate the scenery with the ride than it is to just do it one by one, but you know, I'm impatient, so whatever. We're just gonna sit here and watch, and I'm going to ramble. We better get something good. If we do not get anything good in five days on this game, I'm not even gonna check and see. I'm just gonna try and predict. If it is the balloon if it is the balloon stall or the seafood stall. Or the souvenir stall. I am going to be very angry. It's going to rain again. We, I better get something good. I've saved the game, so you know what? Thank Christ. A hot dog stall. Now we can maybe do a little something something. I'm down with that. Hot dog stall? Fucking hell yeah. Let's get it. I'm down with the hot dogs. Well, bam. Let's get a hot dog stall made at all of our food courts. You may be wondering, Corey, how come you don't make, like... How come you don't make, like, food stalls just randomly placed? Because I, I've never been a fan of that. I feel like if I go into a park and I'm looking for food, I'm not going to find a random food shack, right? Just kind of in between rides. Now, now at rides like Disneyland... And freaking Universal and all that. Yeah, that, that that happens because I feel like that's just the norm. But in this game, I don't like that. I like, I like the ability of food courts, and here's why. If you string along a bunch of, like, well, listen. If you build a food stall, the drink stall is going to have to be close by, right? Because normally what happens is after you eat, you get thirsty. So, I like, I like to think that if I'm going to build... A couple of food stalls then I might as well it's you're also gonna include the bathroom right eventually you can try and string them out all you want but the best strategy to go about it is to build mini food courts a food court of some sort you get like three or four food stalls in there the drink stall and if you're feeling you know if you're feeling generous the ice cream stall I liked I like the ice cream stall you know and there's actually two different types I don't know if the second one is in this game um, but I like making food courts because that's where people are going to spend the money the most in one area. Nobody's going to want to buy a hot dog on the path, sit down and eat, and then walk a little further to buy a drink, sit down again, and then have to find a bathroom or something afterwards. Like, no. I would rather have all the conveniences of food and drink in one area. <laughs> 